I'm Peter Carr outside the Ball State Police Station. Coming up, find out how crime at Ball State compares to other schools in Indiana. All that and more coming up on Newswatch. Live from Ball State University, Delaware County's Emmy Award winning nightly newscast, this is Newswatch. Among the big state universities in Indiana, rates of violent crime are strikingly similar and low. Peter Carr joins us live from Ball State Police Headquarters. Peter? Thanks, Savannah. Crime has been on a downward trend here at Ball State over the last three years. This according to figures compiled by the U.S. Department of Education. But recent well-publicized robberies on or near campus have left some students here wondering about their safety. Robert Vaught spent two years at Indiana State University before attending Ball State. He says Ball State's campus feels less safe than ISU's because of the layout and landscaping. There's less zigzaggy paths, um, less trees, less stuff to worry about whenever you're walking. Here it seems like there's a lot more ways when you're walking for people to hide if they wanted to do something to you. Comparing the numbers for the last full year, here's how crimes of violence stack up in residence halls and elsewhere on the state's biggest campuses. For forcible sex, Ball State had a rate of two incidents per 20,000 students. IU's rate was four. At IUPUI, the rate was less than one. Purdue's rate was one per 20,000. For robberies, Ball State's rate was two incidents per 20,000 students. IU's rate was one. At IUPUI, the rate was two. Purdue's rate was one and a half. And for aggravated assaults, Ball State and IU each had a rate of zero per 20,000 students. At IUPUI, the rate was two and Purdue's rate was one half per 20,000 students. I think Ball State's, it's a reasonably uh, safe committee and I have toured campus with the safety committee uh, looking for possible you know, potential problem areas and uh, uh, overall I'd say that Ball State is, is a good campus. It's a, it's a relatively safe campus. Professor Magro suggests students walking late at night stick to well-lit areas and most importantly, walk with a friend. Live from the Ball State Police Station, for Newswatch, I'm Peter Carr. Thank you, Peter.